so we're on the sons of disappointment dev server and we're trying out a couple of aircrafts in here mainly the three top dogs that are coming i'm still yet to do a video about the harrier b that the that is on the italian tech tree and the entendard well the super entendard on the french tech tree but here well mig 29 everybody talked about it everybody talking about the missile all of that it's too op blah 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 yes it can pull too many g's but yeah you can flare it actually yesterday i was with a bunch of content creators having fun and stuff and i dodged the missiles uh, like 80 percent of the time let's just say 75 percent of the time in a tornado one of the hottest aircraft in war thunder so yeah that's with the r73 uh the er everybody's talking about it they're still complaining about it how fast it is and how quote unquote op it is i don't know keep it don't keep it i'm a, an ir missile type of guy i fly low as you see in this clip i i spike people i come from behind i like flanking so it won't affect me that much personally but if it affects you well that's your opinion good for you uh, another thing is the MiG-29 SMT feels like a flying bucket that's full of bricks. Like seriously, the comparison between this plane and its predecessor, the uh, MiG-21 uh, well, uh, 913 is extremely astonishing. As you can see in this clip, I'm dogfighting an F-16A and the f-16a is just going to outdo me in just about everything if i was uh, in the uh well the mig that we have right now on the live server the 913 i would have gotten him through that first circle no problem but as you can see in here i'm really really struggling with the airplane i'm trying to keep it there maintain it there the r-73 is in a dogfight sometimes they work sometimes they don't it depends on how you use them other than that, the plane is just, like I said, a brick to fly. It doesn't even feel like a MiG-21. I know that the uh, engines still lack in thrust. Gaijin didn't model that. Uh, I know that the aircraft doesn't have its uh, radar uh, well, installed correctly. All of that. I know all of that. But we'll have to wait and see on the live server how this plane would do especially in a 16 versus 16 match that we'll get every single answer at that point dev server really doesn't show you a lot just how everything is going to be the r73 is on the other hand if they get too close like i said in the testing of them with the su 25 bm you're not going to dodge them now moving on to the disappointment of this f16c Man, okay, first things first, I don't know why we got an F-16C, I don't know where the Block 30 went, and uh, yeah, basically we got this thing, it has AIM-9Ls and Sparrows, technically it could operate for Sparrows, technically, however, historically, the US never operated any Sparrows on it, and well it has sparrows on it as you can see which is a little bit infuriating this thing should have had the aim 9 m at this point a little bit better flare resistance than the aim 9 l actually way better flare resistance than the aim 9 l and it should be up there with the python uh, 3 basically they're a little bit different in how they work however let's just say that the aim 9 m is like one to two percent uh worse than the python 3 in terms of flare resistance and that's about it nothing too major nothing too extreme which is something that could have been welcomed on this aircraft i don't know maybe gaijin will still add them other than that it has massive thrust dude let me tell you the plane feels a little bit just a tiny little bit like a brick but the thrust compensates for that and it is amazing to fly i'm starting to enjoy this aircraft and especially if it gets its right ordnance well i'm going to enjoy it a little bit more this aircraft also gives us the ability to carry m rams in the future 
AM120s, so that is absolutely welcomed in the future. Another plane that I'm starting to fall well, in love with is the Barack 2. Barack Obama is here. So, <laughs> this aircraft uh, basically gets 200 countermeasures right now. Uh, this is Gaijin's Block 40, even though that this is supposed to be a D variant of the... I don't know, dude. Just tell me in the comments down below. If it's the D, it's not a Block 40. So, what's going on here? Yeah, correct me in the comments down below. Educate me down there. Tell me what's going on with this plane. But I absolutely adore it. It has the maneuverability. It has the thrust. Actually, the C has a little bit better thrust uh, in the game compared to this one. Maybe that will change. I don't know. It's a twin-seater. Really doesn't matter. Treat it like a... Uh, an F-14 in terms of its crew, and that's that's literally about it. Uh, I strongly believe that this aircraft should get Python 3s and AIM-7, well, AIM-7 Sparrows, AIM-7Ms, I think, because the aircraft could actually mount them. I don't know about historically what they used, but for the sake of top tier, and for the sake of the playability, and for people that are going to grind this aircraft, it is just going to be having to fly with that setup. The AM9L is down there with the R60 now. They are a little bit outdated compared to the new toys that we have in War Thunder. And it would be a shame to see this aircraft. Well, not getting its... Uh, well, not its, but some kind of... Uh, competitive weaponry on it. Uh, this aircraft operated the Python 4. We're still not ready for that at all, but yeah, we'll see. Maybe Gaijin can implement it. I don't know. At the end of the day, they do whatever they want to do, and uh, well, we have to uh, grind it and play it if we want to or don't want to. So, yeah. To be fairly honest, I would love to to see uh, those kind of weaponries on this aircraft, not the Python 4, at least not for now, just Python 3s and a couple of AIM-7s. This will give uh, the Isentrilli Tech Tree a, um, a BVR chance, at least, because they don't have any BVR vehicles down, uh, down the line, except for the Kronas, but it's not really BVR, BVR, if you, if you know what I mean, but yeah other than that i just adore the plane it is fun to fly it is easy to fly i think that it has a chute in the back that is not modeled i don't know dude but it is one of those aircraft that i would absolutely enjoy flying in air rb and especially in sim anyway guys have fun